What's up, fam? It's the Coach Mike Faber, daily conversation. Hope all is well. All right, no matter where, where you are in your journey, I don't care if you're on the mountaintop, if you're climbing the ladder, I don't care if you're barely getting back to your feet or if you're flat on the mat. Welcome home. See, it only is you. We believe that every single person, we know that every single person is capable of greatness, is capable of achieving great things, doing magnificent things, things that will leave a legacy that will be talked about, read about, and heard about long after we're all gone. We know that to be true, that no one's born with the right to be great or certain have this gift to be amazing and others don't, that some go through life unscathed and others just battle. We know that to be not true. We know we're all going to have battles. We're all going to be scraped up and scarred up inside and out. We know we're all going to have to go through life's trials and tribulations. We know that. And all the time I'm asked, Mike, you know, how can you say this? You know, what proof do you have? You know, or, or, you know, what's the key to success or the keys to success? And you know, so many people made these books of seven keys, nine keys, 10 keys, 14 keys, right? And, and, and they all have validity. They all have some truth, right? And they all could be all true. I'm not, I'm not knocking anybody's work. But I can tell you the one thing you need to have. You need to have this thing in order to make it. So when you ask me what's the thing I would talk about, what's the one I would bring up, I'd bring up this. If you work hard for something, you have a chance for it. If you don't, you don't. All right? Know this. The only chance you have to get out of the spot you're in that you despise, and whatever it is, business, in your right job, work, whatever, relationship, friends, or intimate, intimate relationships, all right, associates, any kind, all right, in any line, in anything we talk about, the only way that change can occur is by you putting in the time and effort to change it. So if you were asking me one thing you need to have a shot at making it, I would say it's hard work. I'd say it's putting in time. I'd say it's putting in effort. And people don't want to understand you and people will knock you and they'll talk about you and they'll say you're not committed to other things and they'll say you're not fully in what they want you to be in. Why? Because you're not willing to give them that time that you're chasing your dreams. And let me tell you, the people that really love you sometimes will even not understand it, but some will get it. Some will understand and some will respect it and appreciate it. You putting that kind of time into something to better yourself, better your situation, and better the ones around you. Because it's not about what they think you should be doing. It's about you knowing what you want, what your end game is, what your mountaintop, and how to get closer to it, and then putting in the effort and time to get to it. Because if you don't work hard for your dreams, they will never change. They'll just be dreams. All right? I can tell you that everybody that did these great things that we read about, that we try to make out, that we can't do put in that time and effort. They put in that sweat equity that so many people talk about. They put in that work. And it's not a fancy term and I wish there was another way around it because, oh man, I could tell you some days I don't want to be in the office at this time. But I know if I don't put it in, I won't get it out. And I can promise the same for you. I can't promise you success. But I can promise the only chance you have is by working beyond your belief hard for something. And until you do that, you won't get it. So I hope you'll do that because I want to hear your story about how you achieved it. Put in that work, guys. It's the only way to get it. Peace, love, and happiness. All right. Unleash you. Coach Mike Faber, Daily Conversation. Until next time. Peace.